old slow coach that was going to be last orders waiting for you. Hiya. Hi, hi. Oh, that's right. You two have met already. Hey, come on, pack yourself. We've saved your seat. No, I'll just go and get the drinks. Uh, same again. Same again. Yeah. Uh, I'll come and give you a hand. Look at where it's getting there. Now, you be careful. Just for once, take it slowly. You don't overtake, you don't cut corners, you don't start a race, and you don't take your eyes off the road because you're cruising boys on the pavement. All right? God, you think I'm such a twat. So come on and help me. Beam me up, Scotty. Klingons on the starboard bow. That's your kind of thing, isn't it, Vince? Wrong programme, actually. Oh? What's he called, then? Stavros! <laughs> exterminate! Exterminate! What was that? <laughs> we Nothing. Will I, I just sort of like science fiction stuff. Doctor Who? Yeah. I never really watched it. Well, no. Well, they moved it opposite Coronation Street. I mean, you've no chance, sorry. I remember that. 87 to 89. I had to tape one and watch the other. Do you watch the street, then? Of course I do, yeah. Only me mum, she's given up watching it, cos she says it's full of kids. But it's not true. I mean, Wednesday, it was all Fred Elliott, and then this past fortnight, it was non-stop Rita. It's just not true. The old ones are just as important. God, you really watch it, don't you? Yeah, I love it. Why would I stop paying? He's my kid. And there's some stuff at the back about insurance. Insurance for what? Anything could happen. Could get run over tomorrow. Watch out for a Ford Mondeo. And you know, you could get ill. I mean, I'm not starving, I'm not penniless, but if you were to be out of work, I'd need something. It's for Alfred, not me. Why would I get ill? It covers anything. Like what? I don't know anything. We're not talking months, Stuart. We had you tested, but that was 10 months ago. 40 weeks ago. 281 night stands what? ago. It's for Alfred, really, it is. We've got to be sensible. Fine. Whatever you want. Of course, I'll uh, have to run it past the solicitor. I've done that already. And is he any good? Yeah, I'm fully qualified, thanks. You don't mind, though. It's fine. Fine. The fucking bastard cunts! First they want my money, then they want me dead. Vince, you've got to come out. You're supposed to be my friend. I'm so busy. She's really nice. For fuck's sake! Just tell her you're taking up the arse and get out of there! It's my friend. His mother's in hospital. It's the exact opposite of childbirth. First you have the baby, then you get fucked. In some parallel universe, I just met my wife. See that lot in school? All those couples. What about Coles and Kathy Project and that lot? But half of them's never done it. They haven't. But of course the same. It's desperate. They have a snog and a bit of a thing. And that's it. The girl's home and has a wank. Town please. They're just kids. They're just talking. I'm doing it. I'm really doing it! I'm doing it!
girls and lesbians queue up at her breast to drink the milk. Of course, you know why they chose me, don't you? Because I'm rich and because I'm handsome as fuck, and that's all. She said so, that fucking Lisa. I'm just a gene pool to them, I'm just spunk. Now, there, in with the collar. That's the one went out with Jason Black. Burst into tears, said his mother was dead. Said she died on the Herald of Free Enterprise. Two days later, she turns up. She's been walking the Peak District. <laughs> Mad as a moose. They get benefits, don't they, though, single mothers? Or have they stopped that now? Have they stopped that? I bet you they've gone and stopped that. Oh, stand by your beds. Have you seen? Have you seen? 12 o'clock. Shit. Behave, Stuart, behave. What? The chicken has landed. His name's Nathan, all right. Hi, uh... Hi. How's the baby? Ask my solicitor. Nathan, do you want a drink? Coke, please. Don't. First time we came here, we were 16, older than him. And how long before anyone talked to us? Ages. Go on, be nice to him. But I don't mean shag him. I'll oh, give me some credit. The other hands. He is quite sweet, don't you think? I don't know. I haven't licked him. Well, just passing by. Oh, the now the noses on the faces of the ladies of the harem of the court of King Erectus. Well, just passing by. Now the noses on the faces of the ladies. Just in time, would you look at the twat in the eye? <laughs> well, just passing by. She needs locking up. Some people have no shame. Court She's court like, court like a mong. That's Vince's mother. Yeah, like imagine if it was a proper mong like that. Vinny! Vinny! Mum! Vinny! Just be careful next time. I don't mind, honestly. She's off her head. We don't see much of your mother down here, Stu. Funny that. How are Mr. and Mrs. Jones? Still waiting for Golden Boy to get married. Because, like, my mother, she'd kill me if she knew I was here. Like watching Emmerdale and Zoe Taylor's having that lesbian wedding. And my mother stood up and turned it off. That's not homophobia, that's good taste. <laughs> you fucked him, so it's your responsibility. Don't you dare go swanning off. Everyone's having a go at me. Listen, I have to spend every single day living with me, so I know for a fact I'm lovely, I'm completely lovely. Danny, how's things? Not so bad. How's Peter? Still dead. Oh, yeah, shit, sorry, forgot. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> I should give London another go. I look around this place. I've had them all. Oh, I'm haunted by that problem. You haven't had me. Uh, there was the once. <laughs> no, when? We're in his room. It's not long after I've come over here, right? So we're about 14 or 15. And Vince has got a copy of the Radio Times. Don't tell this story, don't. And we come to this photo, and we're both going like, Ugh. and guess who it was? It was Barry Sheen <laughs> on his bike. In his leathers, God, I'm shamed. It wasn't even black leather, it was red and cream. And we're like, looking at him going, oh, look at him, look at him, and we start sort of groping ourselves, right? And Vince gets it out, not bad either. Oh, fuck off. And I said, gives a go, so I'm giving him a wank, nice and slow, looking down at Barry Sheen. Oh my God, you've had each other. No, no, I'm just about to unzip. When his mother comes back in, he jumps up, he's going, oh my God, oh my God, he's jumping up, sticking it back in his trousers, that was it. That's not sex. It's not sex if you don't come. When Barry Sheen broke his legs, Vince goes down to W.H. Smith, buys a card, sends it to Barry Sheen, London. He was the saddest man on earth. Well, you're giving yourselves away, Barry Sheen. Showing your age. How old are you? How old do you think I am? 33. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off! What? I'm 29. Not for much longer. Six months to go, then it's straight into the bladder control clinic. Then I better go for a piss while I still can. It's not half funny. I've only got three months left. Yeah, but you don't count.